uh, we're here today to, um, as a refresher for all of our first responders on electrical safety and uh, the dangers of down power lines. And uh, it's important for all uh, citizens to be aware of uh, the dangers of electricity since you can't taste it, smell it, or touch it. Mitchell's going to see what kind of voltage we're dealing with to start with. 7,400 volts this morning. We're, uh, we're here promoting safety to, uh, to, to the public and, and certainly to all of our first responders. They're always the first persons that end up on the sites, and especially with car accidents, fire situations, and we're just, we're just promoting safety to give them the, what are the hazards of electricity. James is digging in the front yard. He's out there digging around. Didn't call Miss Utility. Heads up there, gets his shovel in the ditch. All of a sudden, to say it's been a very good demonstration. People have been uh, surprised when they do a couple demonstrations on the fuse blowing. Really gets people's attention and hopefully uh, sticks in their mind just to uh, how dangerous electricity is and just to uh, treat it with respect and stay away from it. Some other demonstrations that they gave were um, ladders on power lines. We have a lot of. Uh, people that uh, have ground ladders, aluminum ladders, so they give a very good demonstration on uh, ground ladders, how dangerous that is with overhead wires and you always have to constantly be looking above you. I guess one of the most important things that I hope that uh, it's important for all of our first responders and all of our citizens is just remember if a power line is down, treat it as a, a live power line, stay away from it, uh, keep everyone away from it and call 911 and uh, report it and uh, the uh, Virginia Power will come out and take care of the emergency. So just treat all power lines as live electrical lines no matter what line is down.